Hello, part two, my Harbor Freight 1,000 pound motorcycle lift, air hydraulic jack conversion from the original pump jack that was in there to a uh, jet 12 ton air hydraulic jack, bottle jack. 12 ton, it's a little bit overkill, but it fits in there pretty good. And after I got it in there, I realized that the bottom was kind of close to the ground, so I had to improvise. I lifted up my wheels by using my inch and a quarter by three inch channel. Welded on. I cut the old stud off that was on there for the axle, and I just put a piece across the whole way there. Well on a bolt, and a lock nut on there on the front. Same thing, only just a short piece. Two, one for each side, a three by three inch, inch and a quarter channel. And I took the original casters and bolted them right on there. And the, the screw, it uh, still works good. So when you get your jack in position, you can screw it and then it locks it, it lifts the caster up. And what I did with my cradle is uh, it's an inch and three eighths inch by a quarter inch steel stock, and I made the cradle eight and a half by five and a quarter inches. And I got an eighth inch steel plate on the bottom of it. I used pretty much all the original hardware that came with it for my relief valve. The hinge, all it is is a rebar held together by an inch and eighth inch square tubing that I drilled holes through and through that square tubing there and I, I cut out a little passageway there to, for the rebar to go through there so that the jack can go like this it kind of teeters you know on that cross member I got the hinge part it's not quite halfway up, it's about a third of the way up from the bottom. So that if an indication of where my angle that I needed for the correct uh, adjustment there, correct height. And on the end of the top of the jack, I had to weld on some Schedule 80. This was uh, inch and 9 sixteenths, inch and 5 eighths, somewhere in that area, diameter, but it fit right in there perfectly and I drilled the hole also with a pilot bolt to hold the top of the jack in place. Everything works good on this thing. Uh, I don't know if you got, I'll give you another little close up here if you want to check it out. My hinge. The, uh, you can see the rebar in there. Sort of, kind of. The rebar is welded to the to the cradle, jack cradle, and then the hinges are bolted to the cross member there. Uh, it works good. Got any questions? This is still a 1,000 pound motorcycle lift. I highly stress that. With the size of the jack, it is. It works great. Thank you for watching.